hi youtube this is your girl amelia and i am back with crazy reviews but today we're just gonna call this mommy's corner and today we're actually gonna be reviewing this hair that i got from one of my friends who who's well one of my facebook friends who's at, just so happens to be from overseas and she offered me a great discount on this hair and this is the closure actually it comes with like it's 300 grams, like 100 grams a piece per bundle. This is the closure, which needs to be bleached. And I won't be bleaching it today because I have no clue how to do that. But as you can see, I'm going to run my comb through it. And when you run that comb through it, baby, them, them curls are just bouncing right back. You know, you stretch and it bounces back. I mean, this got, ooh. And when, and when I do get this in, I'll do a video of that too. Girl, but this got body, okay? This got body. Like, I got body, this has body. <laughs> it's easy to comb through. Then you have, and that's, hold on. That closure is 16 inches. And this, this is actually 18 inches. Out. Let's open it. I will be trying to figure out the seller. I can't remember who the seller was. But I think I paid like $59 for this. Out of, I forgot how much the discount code was, but I know it was like 100 or something beforehand. And of course, you know, you know, you got that, oof. You got that good body in it. Again, it doesn't have a smell. Cause I, oh, I hate. Sorry, guys. That bothers me. Sit that over there. But it doesn't have a weird smell like some, old, like hair from Amazon. I've had plenty, especially Brazilian. It kind of some kind of stink. I would still wash it because it's just, it's just something I do. But for me, the way I've always been able to tell, like, if it's like real virgin hair and whether or not, you know, it's been chemically treated, I wash it. And I look for, like, these little pieces of hair. Hold on. You see how I have, like, a few gray strands? You know what I'm saying? How I have a few gray strands. And, like, people don't understand that real virgin hair does not come already jet black. It, which is usually why it has that kind of, kind of stinky smell. Because it's been processed already. This is hair, like, virgin hair in its natural state. Because these ladies, they do not color their hair. They do not treat their hair with product. They literally just care for it naturally. So they don't use chemicals, colors, or dyes. And, you know, you can just run your fingers through it. I can't wait to install this. I want to see how it can take, it It can take um, dye. I'm not sure how much, because, you know, certain hair, when you bleach it and then dye it, it gets all, yeah. So I'm not, sh I haven't dyed this, of course, so I'm not quite sure, but I will have it colored and dyed and installed into my beautiful big head. But this is nice. This is the first one, and this one's 18. This one's 20. And I have like three bundles in a closure. And usually in each bundle is 100 grams. And you want to aim for... Jesus. If you, in my opinion, you want to aim for 300 grams or more of hair. And you definitely, for a full head, you definitely want at least 300 grams and you need the bundles to actually be thick not thin not 
Like, I've learned the hard way. Some people will take these, like, bundles like these. And see how they're kind of like really thick refs. Hold on. Kind of get down there there. See how the refs on this are kind of thick? Well, <laughs> back in the 90s, and people still do this today, in order to let make hair go longer in, on a tighter budget because you couldn't afford to get that much, they would split the track. You find out where it's sewn, and then you just take a razor blade or a very sharp pair of scissors, and you just get under, just gently under that line. And a lot of people get away with giving you thin, you know, thin layers, like 150 grams, or like, I say 150, and then you like get a, like two, like basically two grams, or they'll give you like 90, 50, the way, that way, if they split it and make it less thick, you have to buy more hair. And that's how a lot of people get their money. But anywho, this hair is, oh, it is beautiful, honey. I can't wait to install this. It's, oh. But yes, as you can see, and it's like still, they're all the same color. They're not some jet black, chemically smelling hair. And it's not, you know, it's not color treated, you know, no smell. I wish I had water, but I don't want to spill on my floor. <laughs> like how this wig is synthetic and color treated that I'm wearing now. And this one's also 16. I would advise you to put the longer ones in the back for more length. And to have more of that textured kind of tapered look. I essentially don't. Okay. Okay, we're gonna put that one down. These are these other ones. And this is another 16. So you got three bundles, 16, 20, no, 16, 18, 20. My bad. Sorry, guys. Quoted you guys wrong. Can't wait to put this on. I hate the netting on this. They always get caught in my fingernails. Okay. Put that over there. And this is the last one. Still the same. Let's get all three together. I'm actually going to leave the netting off. So that when I do call my stuff. The my stylist, she will be able to kind of not worry about that. But as you can see, you know, this is nice. You know, it's really beautiful. It's really bouncy. It's not damaged. It doesn't look eh. It doesn't smell it. <laughs> but I think this is beautiful. What do you guys think? I think it's very beautiful and very unique. And I think I love it, but definitely for the price, I think it was very, very, very good deal. And of course, it says unprocessed, one hundred percent virgin human. Hold on, come on, get in there. I'm turning this knob the wrong way. Okay, I hate doing this. I've never been. See, it says here. This thing gets on my nerves. There we go, human hair. And this says the exact same thing. It's just on a little tag. 100% human hair, unprocessed, natural hair. And you get three bundles in a closure. Now, some people like a lot of volume. I don't like too much. I like 300 is enough for me. Especially for curly hair because you don't really want to look way down or bulky. And this is the closure. 
And everything, I think for $59, this is really good. You know, hold on. Let's see. Let's just hold that up. What do you guys think? Should I leave it natural or should I inevitably like color? Like a red or this color, like a blonde? Drop down in the comments and tell me what you guys think I should, what color you think I should color it. But I think this is good and I really do love this hair. I like this wig. If it wasn't synthetic, I would just wear it every day. But since it is and it tangles a lot, I just wear it every so often. And I think that will be the video for today, guys. I am, by the way, guys, thank you guys for sticking with me. I am still learning this YouTube thing. But I'm just in love with this hair. I'm sorry. It's so beautiful. It smells nice. But I'm going to wash this most likely with some of my um, shampoo. It kind of smells like chocolate. And it's, I like the smell of chocolate, so I'll probably just wash it anyway. But thank you guys for watching, and I hope you guys have a blessed and beautiful day. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Mwah! Bye!